go to dolphinemulator.org, hit this button, download whatever is here or here, but preferably here. Make sure you have 7-Zip installed so that when you get this file, you can then extract it and get this folder. Once you have this folder, you can simply open dolphin.exe. Here, I already have some games because I set up my paths. Just go here, click add, and then add a file path. And if there are ISOs in that file path, this will show up. Then we're going to take an ISO, a GCM, or whatever Dolphin recognizes. Go to files, hit extract entire disk, make sure it's that button. And then we go make a new folder. Wait for it to be extracted. This will take a while, depending on the game. Some games, it's faster. As you can see, it's already finished. And then, where did the game go? Well, in order to find the game, you do need to add the path. So we can add the path here. Make sure you go to the sys folder of this path. Select folder. And now it will show up as zero bytes. Because that is just how Dolphin makes these files look. But I can assure you, it is the game we just opened. As if I open containing folder, here you see it's the same path. Now we can change whatever files we want here. Let's just change a random file. For example, let's, uh, let's rename this to user sus. This will crash the game, but by crashing the game, we know that we've made the effect. And see, it green screens, which means that it immediately crashed. So now that we know that our consequences are real, we hit convert file, convert to ISO, and in extracted game, we can just build GCM file. It doesn't matter if you call it ISO or GCM. You've converted the image successfully. So now if we hit file open, main.iso the green screen so that's just how you extract files with dolphin and build them all in under three minutes thank you